what's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel more importantly welcome back to another gameplay video here on the channel i promise to try to keep on bring you guys more gameplays um when it comes down to me recording from my web browser i have to find the best and most suitable games to record as you guys can see i am here in dungeon quest right now i'm a super noob you know what i'm saying i never really played the game but i have joined the group just to get these sort of like royalties and everything like that a while back but i have never actually played this game but in this game, they have the egg hunt event going on. And what you have to do is you have to take out a wave of these like demonic looking birds. I call them the angry birds, as you guys can see. They're waiting for me to start the match right now. Now, I did already get the um, egg itself and I had some help. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Doing this alone, if you are a noob, is going to be very challenging because there is not just one wave. There's multiple amounts of waves before you hit the very first boss, which is this type of bunny. Now, the bunny looks super cool. You know, it's a little creepy, a little scary, um, but it looks super cool. Now, when you get to that bunny, you have to avoid the ground attacks because there happens to be something toxic, you know, like toxic gas or something that kind of slows you down and it decreases your health. And it can also freeze you in um, your spot for a couple seconds, which will stop you from attacking. But the main thing that you guys want to do is use your special. So as you guys can see right here where it says Q and E, that is where you guys are going to equip the best um, like magical powers that you possess inside of your inventory. So you can use bombs, which is very effective. You can use the carrot um, barrage, which is these dart shaped carrots that rain from the sky. Um, if you have like spikes and everything like that, you can use that as well. If you have fire based attacks, you can use that. Um, but the other thing that people are not saying in these videos that are surfacing on YouTube is how to set yourself up. So right now I'm a noob skin right now. I have nothing on. But when you start your wave, you want to pick a correct gear select or you can load out your own type of um, stuff that you have in your personal inventory. So warrior is a low health type of warrior but he has um enough weapons to get the job done tank has the best health bar it's over 5000 but it's also the slowest and it does not have as much um special effects like far as like the wizardry powers and everything like that then you have mage which is pretty much the same as warrior um, with the health at 2100 and you have a couple of decent weapons and then you have healer which this name itself is self-explanatory um, but if you choose that option you can heal players that you have on your squad when you're attacking and taking out these waves so it's best that you guys discuss what you're going to do before you actually just jump into game you know so let everybody know okay i'm going to choose healer or i'm going to choose warrior and you go with whatever you're going to go with if you're playing with a pro player meaning somebody of a higher level they can choose whatever you know whatever setup they want to go with because they're the best out of your squad you can't really tell them what to do you know so yeah I managed to get the egg with a level 15 pro. Um, shout outs to, I believe his name was Precious Milk or something like that. Um, I can't remember exactly what the name is, but if you are watching this video, thank you for helping me and the other noob <laughs> because we were both level ones, but we both did a good job as noobs. Um, we was helping him out as much as possible. We wasn't allowing him to do all of the work. And then turns out he actually selected healer. So he was healing us as we was receiving damage. And that caused me to be able to get to the final um, mecha bunny boss and take it out and get the egg and the badge in the end.